everyone can kindly take their seats, we would appreciate it. I'd like to take a moment to thank everyone for coming out to the Gates Trilight Performing Arts Center this afternoon. Good afternoon, proud families, faculty, and most importantly, the amazing fifth grade 2023 class of Neil Armstrong Elementary School. It's an absolute privilege to stand before you today as your principal and address this momentous occasion. Today, we will celebrate the achievements, growth, and resilience of our incredible students. First and foremost, I want to congratulate each and every one of you for reaching this milestone in your academic journey. You have demonstrated respect, responsibility, compassion, and hard work throughout the years, and today marks the culmination of your elementary school efforts. Give yourselves a round of applause, students, because you deserve it. Throughout your time at Armstrong, you've grown not only in knowledge and skills, but also as individuals. From the first day you walked through the doors as wide-eyed and curious kindergartners to the confident and capable young individuals you are today, it's been a joy for your families and school staff to witness your growth. Education is not just about facts and figures. It's about character development, building relationships, and becoming responsible citizens. Alongside academics, we have strived to instill values of empathy, kindness, and respect in each one of you. Always remember to treat others with compassion and understanding, for one small act of kindness can have a profound impact on someone's life. As you transition from fifth grade to middle school, embrace the new experiences that lie ahead. Embrace the unknown with open arms and an adventurous spirit. Embrace the opportunities to explore new subjects, discover new talents, and make new friends. Remember, it's through these experiences that you'll continue to grow and discover your passions. But as you embrace the new, do not forget the lessons you've learned here. Cherish the friendships you've made, the memories you've created, and the bonds you've formed with your teachers and classmates. Take the memories with you as you walk into Gates Chile Middle School. And remember that you always have a place in the Armstrong family. We will be here in 2030 when you walk through, this, through our school in your high school cap and gown singing the Armstrong School song to celebrate each one of you. Parents, guardians, and families, thank you for entrusting us with the education of your children. 
Your support, guidance, and belief in their, in their abilities has played a significant role in each one of their successes. Together, we've laid a strong foundation upon which they will continue to build their future achievements. To the dedicated Armstrong teachers and staff, your passion, commitment, and tireless efforts have made a lasting impact on our students. Your unwavering dedication to their growth and development has shaped them into the individuals that they are today. Thank you for being the guiding lights that have helped them navigate their path to success. And finally, to our exceptional fifth grade students. As you stand on the threshold of a new chapter, remember the world is full of endless possibilities. Dream big, set ambitious goals, and work hard to achieve them. Embrace every opportunity that comes your way and never stop believing in yourselves. Congratulations, Armstrong fifth graders. You've made us proud, and we cannot wait to see the amazing things that you accomplish in the future. As you move forward, remember your Armstrong family will always be here, cheering you on every step of the way. At this time, I'd like to welcome our fifth grade flag guardians, John Cochiera and Victoria Lupiani, to come up and lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now we'll enter into some of the awards we'd like to give. The first award that we are going to present is the Spartan Spirit Award. Students, when you receive this award, please stand. This award recognizes students that consistently exemplify the Spartan way, which is respect, responsibility, compassion, and hard work. From Mrs. Wells' class, R.J. Bond, Please stand. Septon. If, if we could please hold our applause until all students are called. So from Mrs. Wells' class, R.J. Bond. Septon Chan. Roman Cherkioglo. R.J. Fontaine. Kristen. Kristen Kada, Marissa King, Eli Montalvo, Helena Nezinchuk, Ariana Rosa, Tofik Saeed, Yusuf Saeed, Brooke Samblin, Rose Suba, and Ashley Whalen. The Spartan Spirit Award for Miss Muhammad's class, Marcellus Andrews, Diana Bess, Jesse Brooks, Brenton Brown, Layla Bruce, Chaz Marie Caradero, Kylie Kapika, Maya. Lawhorn, Nico Minus, Dylan Nuciolo Patterson, Mason Pratt, Tierney Ryan, McCoy Seymour, and Giovanni Ville. The Spartan Spirit from Mrs. Binger and Campbell's class, John Koshara, Cameron Donnelly, Sophia 
Broughton, Sinead Hopte, Grady Lawrence, Victoria Lupiani, Johnny Nguyen, Joseph Provost, Charles Raycroft, Isaiah Said, Selena Santos, Noah Terrence, and Nicole Whalen. The Spartan Spirit Award from Mrs. Finger's Classroom. Victoria Altowell, Zoe Kansdale, Ande Gashi, Maya Repic, Malia Johnson, Richard Lee, Aiden No, Jace Nicholson, Navea Sanders, Sneha Suva, and Daniel Veris Almonte. The next award that we're going to recognize is called Reach for the Stars Award. And I have a special thing that I'm going to share with the four recipients of this award at the end. The Reach for the Stars Award recognizes a student whose academic performance has become dramatically more accomplished over the course of the year. This award acknowledges students who make a sincere effort to earn better grades, elevate particular skills, and encourage others to improve as well. The students know that on Tuesday, they've earned uh, blue tickets for being responsible for the end of the school year. And I was trying to think of a way to determine which students would actually slime Mrs. Scott. The winners of this award, because there's one from each classroom, I think represent everything that our school stands for. And they will be, in addition to the recipients of Reach for the Stars Award, they will be the lucky folks that get to slime me on Tuesday afternoon. <laughs> so, would the following students please come up to receive your award? From Mrs. Well, from Miss Wells' class, Vicki Sambolin. <laughs> from Mrs. Muhammad's class, Layla Bruce. <laughs> from Mrs. Campbell and Mrs. Binger's class. Sophia Groton. And from Mrs. Fingers' class, Nevaeh Sanders. The next award we will present is the Presidential Awards. This award is presented 
to outstanding academic achievement and excellence and is awarded on behalf of the President of the United States and the United States Secretary of Education. It recognizes students who have achieved, achieved academic excellence and is divided into silver and gold. This year's silver winners are, from Mrs. Wells' class, Kristen Kadka, Harold Mingle, Eli Montalvo, Jaxiel Rodriguez. Your awards will be in your envelopes that you receive later. Harold Mingle, did you hear us? And from Mrs. Muhammad's class, Marcellus Andrews, Brenton Brown, Chaz Marie Caradero, Ashton Moore, and Giovanna, Giovanni Bill. And from Mrs. Binger and Mrs. Campbell's classroom, Ava Rodriguez. From Mrs. Spinger's classroom, Connor Midwick. We are also going to call up the recipients for the Presidential Gold Awards. Again, the, these awards will all be in the envelope that students receive at the very end of the uh, uh, ceremony. From Miss Wells' class, Septon Chan, <laughs> J.R. Fountain, Marissa King, Rose Suba and Ashley Whalen. From Mrs. Muhammad's class, Jesse Brooks, Mackenzie Cookman, and Maya Lawhorn. From Mrs. Campbell and Mrs. Binger's class, John Koshiera, Grady Lawrence, CJ Raycroft, Noah Terrance, and Nicole Whalen. From Mrs. Finger's class, Daniel Veras Almonte. Congratulations, students, on all of your hard work and dedication. We have one additional award that was not included in the program inadvertently. This award is the Gates Chi Teachers Association Award. Each year, a portion of the Gates Chi Teachers Association dues, along with funds contributed, contributed by active, retired, and families or estates of deceased members, is allocated to the GCTA scholarship. 
students that are interested in this award would complete an application for the scholarship to be used for a summer enrichment opportunity in an academic area or the fine and performing arts. Students were then selected from their applications by a panel of Gates Chai Lai teachers that, to receive the scholarship. We are proud to announce that this year's GCTA Neil Armstrong Scholarship winner is Septon Chan. <laughs> Septon will be attending the Eastman Community Music School Adventure Music Camp. Please join us in congratulating Septon. Our next award is the New York State Comptroller's Student Achievement Award. The New York State Comptroller's Achievement Award is presented each year to a student who has excelled academically and has also shown leadership potential by volunteering his or her time to serve the school community. This year we have recognized a student from each of the four fifth grade classrooms. Please join us on the stage in congratulations to John Cochera, <laughs> Maya Lawhorn, <laughs> Daniel Veras Almente, and Ashley Whalen. The next award is the Triple C Award. New York State Attorney General Letitia James is pleased to continue the Triple C Awards program to recognize courage, character, and commitment of New York's outstanding students. Whether succeeding in academic pursuits, participating in community service, displaying leadership skills, or overcoming personal obstacles, this student provides us with hope for a brighter future. This year, Neil Armstrong is happy to recognize Marcellus Andrews. And now, to present our fifth grade completion awards. Please come to the stage when your name is called. Victoria Altwell. Marcellus Andrews. Kaylee Avent. Deanna Best. Jeremiah Blair, RJ Bond, Jesse Brooks, Brenton Brown, 
Layla Bruce. Zoe Cansdale. Chaz Marie Caradero. Septon Chan. Roman Cherkioglo. John Koshera. Zoe Cohort. Cam Cam Donnelly. Jonathan Fontaine. Samir Frost. Ande Gashi. Micah Gadsen. Jackson Godshaw. Ellie Gomez. Sophia Gratton. Sinead Hobte. Nazir Hill. Maya Repic. Treasure Jackson. Edie Jacobson. Malia Johnson. Caden Jones. Sujan Kami. Kylie Kapika. Kristen Kadka. Marissa King. Mackenzie Kuchman. Maya Lawhorn. Grady Lawrence. Richard Lee. Victoria Lupiani. Nico Minus. All right, the second half of the alphabet, are you ready? Zayden Michelli. Connor Midwick. Harold Mingle. Eli Montalvo. Ashton Moore. Ty Zay Nelson. You did it! You did it! <laughs> well done, Ashton. Polina Nesenchuk. Aiden, no. Johnny Nguyen. Jace Nicholson. Dylan Nuciolo Patterson. Mason Pratt. Joseph Provost. CJ Raycroft. Dylan Reeves. Giovanni Rivas. Josiah Rivera. Camille Robinson. Ava Rodriguez. Jexie L. Rodriguez. Ariana Rosa. Tierney Ryan. Jordan Sadler. Tafiq Saeed. Yusuf Saeed. 
Isaiah Saeed. Brooke Sambolin. Navea Sanders. Selena Santos. McCoy Seymour. Danielle Smith. Rose Suba. Sneha Suba. Noah Terrance. Daniel Veras Almonte. Giovanni Ville. Raylan Westner. Ashley Whalen. Nicole Whalen. And Sally Yes Alert. Well, congratulations to everyone. Let's give them one more round of applause. <laughs> Students, we wish you all of the best in middle school and we'll be watching to see all the wonderful things you do. Um, we just want to say before we have our closing um, video presentation that if you are going to take your student home with you today, please make sure you've signed out with your classroom teacher. There will be one bus going back to Neil Armstrong for those who may need to ride the school bus back to school and ride home. We thank you parents for all that you do um, and we look forward to watching this video presentation. Thank you for coming.
that you dance around in your PJs getting ready for school. Oh, darling, don't you ever grow up, don't you ever grow up, just stay this little. Oh, darling, don't you ever grow up, don't you ever grow up, it could stay this simple. Nothing's ever left you scarred And even though you want to Just try to never grow up Take pictures in your mind of your childhood dropped me off it's so much colder than i thought it would be so i tuck myself in and turn my night light on
things are supposed to do, oh yeah.
again, thank you families for all your support, love, and hard work. Uh, we couldn't do this without you all.